character of this cat, have him on the entire page and composing. You want to try to think of your composition. I have him all angling down here. I could have put him closer in the corner. I just want to make him kind of midway into that. Here's the line of action again. And then focused in, at least starting off with the circle for the head shape. There's for the, the rib and the torso. And then once that's in there, still start maybe off with the skeletal piece. So here's the shoulders, just little indications of the dots for the elbows and the wrist. This one's kind of a also a gesture of a arm going up. You can't really see the shoulder it elevates itself. And then coming down to the part that represents the hips in cartoon anatomy and then this going to the knee to the ankle to the foot and just sketch this out. And that'll give you at least the, the beginning part. The circles for the torso, if you connect them, just giving you a little bit of the torso, the tail coming through, kind of the spine shape. And if you do put circles for the knees, the heels, and the hips, then it makes it a little bit easier to create these shapes by drawing through the object there. So, same with the shoulders and the arms. So if you can make the circles on the elliptical shapes, just kind of builds that up a little bit. And then here's the face. So again, you have to kind of get used to how these characters are drawn. Here's the horizontal line, the center line. Got a lot of lines going in here. Here's the circle for the mouth. And if you find the central part for that, and right where the eye line is, that's where the triangle is going to be for the nose, giving you these two circular pieces for the teeth, kind of the fangs coming out. And then the lower section of that being the, the lip down below. And then when you take a look at the elliptical shapes for the eyes going around in perspective, there's the parts for the pupil iris. And again, depending on if you put a highlight, I'm going to slide the iris in there as well. And then they have the circle for the fur shape. So there's a almost like a band down the middle, like a stripe. And falling right off of that is this elliptical shape, a little larger. So it gives you that. The head kind of has a triangular point to the top. And then the side, side cheeks coming around. So you can kind of see that section in there. And the eyebrows are kind of listed in the eyes here. Okay. The triangle shape for the ears, if it wraps itself around, you can kind of see where it starts and the inside giving you a little bit of the fur. And then the cheek whiskers here. The opposite side being s symmetrical, a little bit smaller. And gives you that piece, a little bit of pointy here at the top. So that gives you a pretty good definition of the, of the face. Okay, and then as you start to locate the neck, again, this is all in that line of action, so you want to try to keep that in there. Circle for the shoulder, goes back to this elbow. Up into this hand, so that's where you want to try to see the hand is also a little bit of gesture happening there. So here's a circle, just like we've done before, the mitten. And then here's the inverted thumb and the pinky coming out like that. So once you have that listed in there,
that part up. Come down to this shoulder. This has a little bit of foreshortening happening, the shoulder, the elbow coming out. Move the hand back a little bit. There's the circle for it. Okay, it has a little couple fingers out this way. belly of the cat. Mm. And here's the shape of this guy. So again, as the knee, try to think of the cylinder for it. Comes down to the circular part. It might change as you start to get the proportion going. Build that part of the foot, kind of gets the flat pressure that's on there. Take a look at the other leg. Putting the three circles for the toes overlapping themselves helps you with the perspective of it. in the drawing there. Again, once you take a look at it, I'm going to go back and fix this hand right here. Got a couple minutes here. I'll kind of Okay. 